Whether it's a tiny studio or a huge mansion, I'm going to teach you how to make money in real estate. The small apartment had been used as an office. There's only a $20,000 makeover budget, but Carol's intent on making quite a difference. This apartment that's currently worth $650,000 will increase in value to at least $950,000. A big challenge is how to make this tiny kitchen larger. That's a job for handyman Bill. It needs a major kitchen redo. The what? biggest flaw in this kitchen, unfortunately because of the size, there is no refrigerator. Okay. There's a dishwasher, but believe it or not, the owner kept a refrigerator on the other side of the front door. I so we're going to fix that though. We're going to fix it, increase the value. Um, what I'd like to do is blow this wall open, pull out the ground, granite countertop to make it feel as though it's twice as big. And I want to keep it light. You know, this kitchen has no window, light's an issue, I want to keep it light. We'll just have to rip out these boards, install new, and then I would like all the floors sanded and polyed in a slightly deeper natural finish. Right now they're pickled, which is really too much of a beachy look. One of the highlights of my job is shopping, especially with someone else's money. Not looking to spend a fortune today. This is a small renovation, converting a studio apartment into a one bedroom. A little trick I have when I want to lighten my clients' apartments, change the light bulbs. Go from 40 watts to 100 watts. If that doesn't work, add new lights. I'm choosing these to be the sconces for the living room. Two on either side will really brighten up the room and be perfect. Kitchens are so important. If you want a kitchen to really impress a buyer, my number one choice for countertops is stone. No question about it. I want to keep it monotone. Monotone and light. This is very pretty. I like both of these. This is the one. Juperana Fantastico. I love the wild variation of color. Overall, it's light, which is what I want for the apartment. It picks up the gray of the stainless steel appliances and the oak color of the floors. Fantastical. I'm looking for classic. Not too modern and not too traditional. This dining room table is great. I love the glass. It's an airy look. And these chairs go perfectly. I'm going to take this. I am not eating that. Oh, I love this mirror. Another tip, you cannot go wrong with mirrors. They add light and depth, make every room feel bigger. I'm taking that one. Less is more. I don't go crazy renting a ton of furniture. Flowers are always a key feature of any apartment staging undertaken by Carol. They're flown into Manhattan from all over the world, and Carol knows just where to shop for exquisite wholesale flowers at the lowest prices. The makeover maven loves a bargain. I'm looking for a double orchid, bright color to stand out. They last several months need very little care and are great, great for staging an apartment and making it look much more upscale. This is the exciting part when I see the whole transformation. In uh, less than an hour, the kitchen will be gone. The numbers in my head start rising about how much this apartment is worth. Up, up, up. Today, Carol E. Levy is supervising the furniture staging for a studio that she's converted into a one-bedroom apartment in just a month. In Carol's case, real estate broker is a term that covers a multitude of skills. She's an architect, 
interior and exterior designer, project manager and expediter, a stager and decorator, prepared to do whatever it takes to make an apartment sell for the highest possible price. The Makeover Maven does it again. Beautifully refinished hardwood floors, freshly painted walls in a light color, exquisite new lighting, wonderful new furnishings to give scale to the rooms, and the finishing touch of the fresh flowers and plants. I fit in a full-size stainless steel refrigerator, lovely light maple cabinetry, the Juperano Fantastico granite countertops, aren't they fantastic? I extended them out a foot, which made the kitchen look twice the size. With this mini makeover, transforming a studio into a one-bedroom apartment and a budget of only $20,000, I've increased the sale price from $650,000 to $950,000. The next episode, it's up, up and away as Carol weaves her magic with another luxury penthouse makeover. You simply won't believe how much she increases its value. It's got the ultimate view in New York. 